Hello everyone, another day, another topic and today's topic is catalytic efficiency and turnover number of enzyme. So this is from biochemistry from enzyme. These two properties of enzyme is very very important for mathematical problem, analytical problems and questions. So what is catalytic efficiency? What is turnover number? What are their formula? What are their significance? What that means? So let's talk about it. Okay. So, so much information in this video. So catalytic efficiency is denoted as K cat by Km and turnover number is denoted as K cat. In simple terms catalytic efficiency equals to turnover number by Km. That's what we can easily write. So now let's look at the catalytic efficiency that is K cat by Km. The equation is K cat by Km. K cat means turnover number divided by Km. Km is a Michaelis constant, right? Simple. Now you'll see the property of catalytic efficiency. It represents the efficiency of an enzyme to convert substrate to product per unit time as substrate concentration. So at a given substrate concentration, how much substrate can be converted to product per unit time by an enzyme is known as the catalytic efficiency of that enzyme. What is the significance of this? Why do you need to understand catalytic efficiency? To compare the efficiency of different enzymes or enzyme variants to each other. So we can compare that X enzyme is better than Y, Z is better than X, like this. So turnover number on the other hand, K cat, what is the formula or equation? K cat equals to V max by total enzyme concentration. The maximum velocity divided by the total enzyme concentration. That means there are two variables, the maximum velocity the enzyme reaction can reach and the number, the amount of enzyme that is present. So what is the property of it? It indicates the number of substrate converted to product per enzyme active site per unit time. Depending on enzyme active site, that means if a single enzyme has multiple active sites, so it has higher chance of turnover number, higher turnover number. Okay. So multi subunit proteins will have this. So it will convert more substrate into product per unit time per active site of the enzyme. Keep this in your mind, print it in your mind. Okay. And what is the significance? Quantifies the catalytic activity of an enzyme. If we consider enzyme as catalyst that helps to convert substrate into product. In that case, this turnover number helps us to understand whether X enzyme is better than Y enzyme in converting the substrate into product. If the turnover number of X enzyme is 10 and turnover number of Y enzyme is 50, that means the Y enzyme can convert 50 substrate into product per unit time per active site. So Y enzyme is a better enzyme than A. That's the simple idea about the catalytic efficiency and turnover number. Keep this in your mind, print it, do, do not forget this ever because you will get many questions from this in years to come. Believe me, very, very important one. So watch this whole series of mind map and it's our journey of 365 days. One mind map every single day for a year. And I bet you that you're going to come up as a better source of knowledge for the field of biological sciences after this one year of study. So continue with this series because it's going to provide you benefit for CSIR net get ls get biotechnology icmr jrf uh, the q8 pg uh, bhu jnu examination and all the other institutional phd entrance examination as well so if you like this video please hit the like button share this video with your friends and subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that in future all the very best for future career